What's going on, cuckolds? We're back with Super Mario Galaxy 82 stars in, and uh, yeah, let's. I don't, I it's been a couple days since I've played actually. He doesn't have any letters for me, usually, he does when as soon as I come in. So, uh, what the fuck? Uh, where should I go next? Did I got Luigi? I got I unlocked these things, that's right. Uh, maybe I should check to see if any other places got, um, you know, uh, any shits in orbit, any prankster comets. Gotta check them out, you know, because. Uh, I like to get them if I can. Yes, we got the good egg. We got a purple comet. I don't, I don't think I've seen that before. Purple comet in orbit. Gotta smoke some perp. Smoke some of this perp com. Um, yeah. Let's check it out. It is. Okay. Purple comet in orbit. And we got ourselves the purple coin omelet. Coin omelet? <laughs> the fuck? Alright, um... I guess you gotta collect purple coins. Ah, so it's kind of like the blue coin challenge. You gotta get all the purple coins and such. Is it timed? Why well, do I have a feeling it is? Don't be timed. Yes. Right, it's not. Is this gonna say something about it? I Probably not. You collect 100 purple coins to make something neat happen. And that means get a fucking star. I'm not dumb. I, I wanna get these. <laughs> when I see something like that, it's hard not to break them. But we're coming along quick in this, uh, fucking, whatchamacall, oh, that, is there any more on here? Should probably check, you know, you never know. Don't wanna have, don't wanna go to the next planet and not have all the ones here. Uh, I guess that's all of them. Um, oh shit, I almost walked right into that. Uh, yeah, what was I saying? I mean, we're coming along quick in, in, in Galaxy here, you know, oh nice, that's sick. Oh shit, I was going to this planet, now it's taking me to a different one! Ah, how am I gonna get back? Alright. Well, we'll figure it out. 35. This is cool, I mean, it's chill. It's easy, you just gotta get all the coins. But, um... Purple coins. They were purple in uh, Odyssey, that's right. Because they were blue, and you've had the red ones, obviously. There's no red ones in this game. Every other one, you've got red coin challenges. Um, that looks like all the coins here. But, uh, yeah, I mean, Galaxy, so far, it's been the easiest game, I'd say, out of all of the, um, you know, 3D All-Stars games. Up, oh, that was here already, but we want to go to that one here and and not shake, don't, or press Y. When we get to this, uh, one, we just go straight through. Yep, and we'll get these purple coins. Good shit, good shit. Whoa, Nelly. Yeah, yeah, tricky, yeah. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Whoa. Oh, let's just see what's up in here. It's probably just some more star bits, but you never know. Hit it. Give me my star bits, bitch. Star bitch. Star Lord, man. Legendary outlaw. Um, hold up. We got something here, too. That's just for a fucking coin. Are you kidding? That's it. What are you going for? Woo! So now we go over here. We're 70. We need 30 more. Nice, baby. And we're going to want to shake this one. Hey, 20 more. There's going to be 10 of them. Ah, it's here already. Uh oh. I think I know what it is. I think I know what it is. We have to go to um, ba -ba 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 -ba, this one. Ba 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 ba. And then, um, I shake into this one, right? So we got these. Shake into this one. And then, um, there should be another star over here that I shake into. Um, ba -ba 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 Like, see, watch. And then, I, I, I was coming to, to, uh, the, some planet here, and I shake here is what I do. And this should take me here. They get it. Easy. And they better be take me to the star planet. <laughs> I, I did it out of, like, uh, quote-unquote order, so that's probably why it didn't take me to the planet I need to go to. I don't know which planet it's on now. I think it's this one right here, hopefully. does Doesn't look like it. It's that one over there. Fuck. Please take me there. 
Are we going there? I think so. I think so. Don't, don't do it. Nice. Give me my fucking purple star. They should do more of these. These ones are cool. These purple coin ones. I mean, they're, they're easy, but they're fun. It's always fun collecting things is, is my, like, interpretation of it. Like, you could do that with, not with 64 so much. I mean, they had the 8 coin ones and the 100 coin, uh, levels. Um, but Gal, or... Uh, Sunshine had the blue coins and of course the red coins and the hundred coins um, And this one, you know, it has, doesn't really have anything like that I mean unless you can collect star bits and you have to in aspects, but it's easy to get them It's so easy and you don't even have to like go out of your way to get them either, you know, so this should be everything here um, Honey hive has another one. So there's like multiple ones like for sure that will be coming down maybe each one of these you know big three star galaxies have like Every single kind of pranks are common, and it just depends when they're in orbit. But I, I got what I can for now, and we gotta wait. That's a cool aspect of it, is that, like, you, you kind of... It, it encourages you to keep moving forward, because you'll have to come back. And I like the fact that you have to come back, because it's, you know, it's like replay value. And it's like, yes, you could have had it all there, and I'd still be on it, you know? Opposed to, like, having to come back if I could have just done it from the start. But it's kind of cool. See if anything's in orbit here. Space junk. Still waiting for some space junk uh, thing to be in orbit here. So fuck it. Let me out. <laughs> and then we'll go over to uh, the kitchen or the bedroom or something. Wait, this green thing. Don't go away. Nice. Nice little shortcut to the bedroom. See if anything's in here for me to... Uh, blah, blah. Anything in? Nope. Freeze Flame. Waiting for Freeze Flame and Gusty Garden to be in orbit. And Dusty Dune. So, nothing's in orbit here. But, uh, a lot of things I need to get done. That's some BS. Then I guess we'll check out the kitchen. Because someone's always in the kitchen stirring up a ruckus. And then we'll go to the engine room, of course. And then I unlocked the last one. And then I'll go there. But, uh, let's check out the kitchen. The stove is, uh, is on fire. Nothing's in orbit, but, again, beach bowl, ghostly, and the, uh, the fuck? There's a green star there, I got. I don't even remember. I guess that's where I found Luigi. I don't know. I found Luigi in the ghostly galaxy, and then I found him in Good Egg, and then I found him in the other place. I don't know what that green star's about. I don't fucking remember. But... Alas, uh, we'll go in here and see if anything's in orbit here. And if not, then we'll just go on to the next fucking place. You know, I ain't got time. Maybe it depends on the stars you get. You you get certain stars that'll unlock the orbit of other ones. Uh, sea slide is in orb, not in orbit. Gold leaf, toy time, all got some shit for me. But I can't access them. So yeah, I guess I, you just gotta keep moving forward. Is what it it seems to be to me that it's suggesting. Yes, sir. Yow, did I unlock this guy over here? Do you have anything to say to me? Want to go to the Sand Spiral Galaxy? No, I went there. Right, I did that? I think I did. Too fucking bad if I didn't. I'll get to it eventually. <laughs> Damn, so I. What is this place? And then that's the place up there. What is this bitch gonna say? He's gonna tell me what it is. This is the gate. To what? What the fuck does that mean? Oh. There's probably some shit here. There's probably something here, right? Just star bits. I guarantee there's something here. That's the comet. Or not the comet. The, the whatever you want to fucking call it. I mean, we got, our, we got ourselves a warp pipe here. What happens if I go up here or anything? I mean, I know this is where fucking, yeah, Rosalina was at. Is she going to tell me some bullshit? Uh-oh. Don't sneak up on her. That's Peach's mom. This planet, it's very dear to me. I looked forward to visiting this planet with the Lumas every 100 years. The Luma that's been traveling with you may also grow up to become a star someday. Some Lumas become planets, some become comets, and a few become fucking power stars. I'm traveling with them while they look for a place to be reborn. But I never thought all this would happen. Wow, Mama must really trust you. Well, how about this? 
If you grab all 100 purple coins here, then you'll earn my trust too. This is a red star. Power of the red lumas is what it holds. I missed that part. <laughs> but the really amazing part about it is it allows you to fly after you spin in midair. Yes, fly. While pressing B, you can pick the direction you want to fly with L. If you can collect 100 fucking purple coins, I'll let you use my power somewhere else. Please don't have a timer. Oh, shit. Hey, I never had this one. Yeah, I never got this far. You transformed into flying Mario. Spin when jumping to fly. Whoa. Oh, shit. I missed one. At least it's not timed. I'll come back for it. This is nuts. Does it stay just as long as whatever? Or does it run out? Fuck. Man, I'm missing a lot. <laughs> 24 to 100. Fuck me. Oh! Yeah, I may just get all these while I see them, you know? I feel like I should go back in the air and get those ones because it's clear that I missed them. Fuck it. <laughs> Whoa, don't miss, don't miss, please don't miss. You missed! You missed both, you fucking moron. I can't move the camera in a better fucking direction. It's hard to fucking... Like, I'm turning my head sideways right now. Please get that, dude. 32. 1, 2. Whoa. <laughs> God damn it, I'm gonna be doing this forever. God damn, please. You're right on the money. You're right on the money with that. Bang. Alright, got another. Uh, up a little, up a little. Urgh, you fucker. Okay. Uh, uh, to the left, up. Nice. Uh, to the right, to the right. Fuck, I'm missing this shit. I keep missing these fucking two, these assholes. Give me these, uh... Motherfuckers. I think he runs significant. No, maybe not. I was gonna say he runs a little slower. Well, I was in the middle of saying significantly slower with this power up, but nah, never mind. Maybe a tiny bit, but I doubt it. Get on the fucking. Oh, I didn't mean to even do that. All right, well let's try and get these two in the fucking air while I'm fucking here. My head's turned fucking sideways. Oh my god, I can't get these two, yo. Jesus Christ. Just fucking get on the ground. We're more than halfway there. Let's get all these bitches. Yeah, just run into that. Like, what are you doing? It sounds like it's running out, which is fine. Yeah, I don't need to get it right. Those ones in the air right at the moment they can be the last ones i get please jump up dude what are you doing are you f what do you do you have asperger's fucking jump up what the fuck like i have to go around like that the fuck is this shit all right we're getting there Oh, God. See, I knew coming here was going to be worth something. I'm almost there. 84. 5. It's crazy, though. That's funny. that Like, I actually just did a purple one, and then now I have... And then I had, um... Then I have this other purple coin one to do. 13 left. You know, there's going to be a few I'm missing. Not just the ones in the sky, but, like, I'm going to be like, Where are these other ones? Maybe not. Hopefully not. Oh, can we get that? You know, don't make it difficult. Just jump backwards. There we go. One fucking here as well. One fucking here. I can see with the shadow that I'm missing. Yeah, that one. Just jump. There you go. Maybe it'd be easier if I was flying just to grab these, but I feel like it wouldn't. I'd keep hitting the thing. I'd miss them all. Not that I'm getting them every time I'm here, but, you know, with these jumps, but still. Good God. It's just so annoying because of the way the camera is. You can't fucking... 
accurately like decide which way you're jumping it's like come on 93 you know we're missing at least two in the in the air god no come this way oh my god Come on, I'm right there. Don't slide down the fucking thing. Just jump back. There we go. Shout out, Gooms. 96, 97, 98. And these two in the sky. Oh my god, I cannot get the angle on this. Oh! Spin back around for it. Oh my god, that's so annoying. The camera won't change if I spin back around, so I have to go all the fucking way back around. Uh, just for me to miss it 5,000 more times. Please. Hey, got the red star. Cause it was a flying star. Whoa, I'm so high up. Bow, 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 bow. Bow, 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 bow. Oh. Haha, -ha, I don't have to jump up. Hell yeah. That's sick. Got the gate star. I wonder if there's any more here. Well, I feel like there might be if I just do a little more exploring. Like there's that green pipe. It might lead to something. 36 away, baby. Maybe it changed to 35 after this. Maybe not. Let's see. Nice. Galaxy. Galaxy complete, I mean. Hungry Loom has appeared right outside of uh, where I was. Uh, save my game, user. And game save. Yeah, still 36. Um, we're going to go back up there. Is there a way to check if I got the sand spiral thing already without going to it? I don't know. I don't know. But, oh, it's got the red star up there. I can just fly up there. Is that what it's... Yes. Sweet. Let me just fly up there, baby. I saw one up over there. That's pretty sick. This is cool. This is where we want to go. Let me just uh, feed this hungry bitch. How many do you need? 1200? I think I got that. I do. But if another one appears, I'm going to need a lot more star bits. <laughs> Good lord. It's probably going to need 1,400. I think it goes up by, uh... I'm stuffed! I think it goes up by, what's it? Like 200 every time. The Booze Boneyard Galaxy has appeared. Scary. Um, let's go in here. Let's go back in the gate. And see. It's, uh... I mean... Yeah, I mean, I don't know. I guess there's nothing. It should pop up, right? If there was something. Um, fuck it. Let's do this one. Yes, I do. Let's go. Ooh, let's go. Yahoo. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Racing the spooky speedster. Ah! Uh oh. Okie doke, okie doke, okie doke. Yes. Alright. Um, I guess we'll jump up in here. You know, that's the only solution. And, uh. Whoa. Oh, need a. Need a boo. Just wanna read the sign if it'll let me now. It's not going to. Fuck, I gotta go B. There we go. Uh-oh, I gotta race as Boo. <laughs> so you're after it too? You'll have to race me for it. Uh, I guess you're talking about a star. <laughs> Here we go. 
God damn it. <laughs> I don't know if there's a way to go faster. This bitch just go down. I don't know how to go faster. The fuck? Uh, how do I do it? How do I... Okay, it's that. Gotcha. Whoa. This is the... These are shortcuts, guaranteed. Guaranteed. Unless I'm... I just went backwards now. I think I did. I fucking did. Fuck. Is there a way to restart this? <laughs> Damn it. I'm fucked. Go! Can you go any slower? The fucking hell? This dude cannot possibly be going any slower. There we go. This is all good. We're fine. It's all good. It's fine. I know now, and we'll do it again. Hee 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 hee! One twenty eighty-five, huh? Better luck next time. Oh no! I lost this Blue Mario. We'll get him again. Just jump right back up in this shit. Oop! Just miss it. <laughs> I just want to read this, see what it's telling me before. I only talk to booze, so get lost. Fuck you. So Y, and then this will go down, this goes up. That's what I gotta remember. Yes, 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 we know. I'm ready, and I'm going to beat you this time, bitch. Because I had the lead, but I didn't realize I fucked up. <laughs> go... I pressed it, yo. Come on, don't be stupid with me. Fuck. I can tell Boo's coming. Oh my god, you're so slow before he comes. Hey. 50 seconds. It's a lot better than last time. Hey, 50, 45? Well, a promise is a promise, so take this fucking star. Hell yeah, bro. You had it the whole time? I'm like, what? I thought we were racing like for it. What do you mean you were after it? If that means you had it already, bro. Mm-mm. Thanks, Boo. King Boo, whoever. Yeah. 35, baby. Halfway through the episode, too. That's how I like it. We got we got some stars to get. Yazer. Yazerski. The garden is where I must uh, go next. I could always take a dip into the storybook. It's been a while. Been a while, ain't it? But let me get this uh, shit, and then we'll fly up. Let's go this way this time. Because I know it's right up here. Oh, let me get that one up, just because. Just because. And then we'll fly down, and we'll fly back around. Nice. Oh, shit. Oh, oh god, that was close. <laughs> and let's go to the garden. Can I fly to this place over there? I feel like I can. You know what I'm saying? I feel like, or maybe that thing's gonna unlock it to let me go there. Oh shit! The garden. Yeah, I, ain't, I ain't never been here yet. Oh man, let's unlock these. This is like that special one. Let's see what that one is. 
It is Master Splatter. That one sounds crazy. Here we've got ourselves fucking Deep Dark. That's scary. Then we've got, uh... Dreadnought. That sounds wild. And is the Bowser one? Oh, there's no Bowser one. I guess this is actually pre-beat, or post-game beat. Melty Molten. That one sounds fun. But I, I did, uh, Deep Dark first. Let's do it. It's gonna be scary. We got a boot. It's tropical on the outside. You go inside. It's a little scary and dark. Alright, alright. It is the underground ghost ship. Look. It's not like in water though, right? Because I fucking hate the swimming. Woo! We got ourselves the toad ship. Yes. Uh, let me up there, please. Damn it. Nice. Can I climb up these? Nope. What? I'm trying to get whatever this thing is. Bitch. What the fuck is it? Is it money? Oh, star bits. Damn. Alright, um, some crabs. Get this thing. This one's scared of me. Underground ghost ship. Oh, there's a cannon right here. And also, I can light those things on fire. You wanna talk? Snore Z, bitch. Hold up. Maybe if I ground pound this, I'll go flying little. Of course, I missed it. Nah, okay, uh, under, there's a thing there, I need a shell, obviously. Um, there's a shell. <laughs> Let's just get it. Woo! -hoo! It's probably just a one-up or some bullshit. Oh my god. There we go. I like how they have flashlights on them, like, that's weird. Like, since when? I know these things can miss, so I gotta get up close. Just a one-up, yep. Well, one-ups are good. They are good. Better than to be one down. Now let's get into the fucking cannon. Oh, I didn't talk to these toads. Maybe I should talk to the treasure tracker guy. Come on in! Get all your can in the cannon! You fucking stupid, bro. We're currently on VK, or I mean galactic survey duty. Please be patient with us. Fuck you. <laughs> That's what I gotta say. Now let's, uh, let us be blasting away over here, clearly. Or there's one over here. Wait, that's the gate, right? Yeah, that's the gate. That's the fucking gate. Uh, I obviously gotta go here, so let's do it. Oh god, I missed... God. Oh lord, I'm gonna die. I gotta light these things. No, the fucking thing got in the way, are you kidding? Oh god, that was close. Thank god. <laughs> I didn't get the thing from all those guys, but whatever. We'll go another time. Oh, we got a Kamek, bitch. Get over here. Ain't no problem. Alrighty. I knew there was going to be swimming involved. But let's see what this blue nerd toad has to say for himself. Just a coin? This team is surveying an underground lake. Yeah, thanks. So I guess I got to go down. The underground ghost ship is what it's called, right? We got... Um, we got bloopers. Ah! Fucker. Bitch. I should get these bubbles while I'm here, because it seems like a long hike down. You know what I'm saying? Fucking get out of here. <laughs> this music's scary too, I don't like it.
Let's get this shell and I'll move a little faster. And then I can get this. Oh god. Uh, let's see, what the fuck am I supposed to do? Up. What the fuck you mean up? I have a feeling I wasn't supposed to go up, but now I'm up and I'm pissed. This just said up. Well, I'm so glad the shell didn't, like, break from that. Maybe I'm supposed to... I think I'm supposed to go down. Fuck it. We don't need the, uh... The bubbles this time. They're gone anyway. I got the shell for them. Whoa. Let's see what I'm supposed to do down here. I mean, there's clearly a, a ship. Do I blow those things up? Is it as simple as that or what? I think it might be. It just seems too simple, you know what I mean? Oh god, yep. Okay, I'm an idiot. Oh god, before I run out of air, before I run out of air, before I run out of air, before I run out of air. Whoa! Oh man. Oh shit. Ooh, star. Oh, it's a boo, you fucker. I have to get up there and turn that somehow. Oh. Okay. You fucker. Oh my god, I do not want to die. Oh, thank god. I'm just gonna get this fucking thing out of here. I shouldn't have done that. Oh my god! Ooh, just missed it. I... Like, get the fuck out of my way. <laughs> I know that's the point, but it's like, fuck off, dude. From here? You can put, like, come on. Fuck off. Well, now I know I really can't be fucking up. I can make it to this one down here without having to get sidetracked by the second, the first bubble. Like, fuck off. Don't fuck with me. It's faster if I swim like this. Oh, fuck is this? I didn't notice this shit before. This is something uh, completely else <laughs> that I'm getting sidetracked by, but fuck it. Oh god, I don't think I could even come up here. Yep, that's for another day. That's for another day. Fuck. Well, got sidetracked. It's another mission. But we are going below. Oh god, I'm running out of air. Well, we got a bubble down here, right? Eh. Where's the... Where's the shell? Where's the fucking shell? Well, I used it and it's gone now? Or does it mean it's unlocked and I just have to go into the star this time? Please, don't, don't fuck with me. What the fuck? Can I shoot at it with star bits? Looks like it. The fuck? They're growing back. What the fuck is this shit? Where's the shell? Like, huh? Oh, it's over here now? Like, what? 
I just wasted my star bits. All right. Like, why me shooting with star bits didn't work? I don't know. I guess they all have to explode at the same time. At the same damn time. At the same damn time. Alright, let's fucking do it this time. Without getting injured. Let's save that in case I need it. The fuck was that shit? Let's try that again. Fuck. Fuck. Oh my god, what, yo? I hit the thing so I can hit the fucking stupid shit. I think I gotta get booing on this fucking bullshit. And this thing's just in my fucking way. Get over here, yo. These guys are just in my fucking way. Here we go. Get over here, get in the sunlight. Dancing in the moonlight. Everybody's feeling warm and right. Thank you. Oh, oh, put it over there so I have to change the shit again. You fucker. What the fuck? Huh? The fuck is happening? If I die from this thing now... <laughs> oh god, I swear to fucking Christ. I swear to the fucking Lord. Sort of the fucking most. Keep bouncing on it. I didn't tell you to stop, you fucking prick. Thing's very fucking dangerously close to me. Get off the fucking thing! Jesus Christ. <laughs> you wanna piss a man off? Well, that's the first star in the fucking garden. <laughs> what I think we'll do now is read some more of the storybook. Because at the end of the episode, there's not quite a lot of time left. So we'll just go read a couple chapters of the storybook. Can't remember where I left off. Because I fucking accidentally skipped through the last couple pages by accident. I pressed the control stick. <laughs> Excuse me. I pressed the fucking control stick and I meant to press, like, you know, not the control stick. <laughs> but here we are. Little shortcut. In the library. Gotta study. He's always surprised when he walks in, like, oh! <laughs> like, why? You've been here now, too. It's not even like that surprising in the first place if it was your first time. Let us begin. Begin. Did I finish it? Chapter 3. Did I do chapter 3? Maybe I didn't. Chapter 3, the comet. A beam of light pierced through the ship's window. Thinking it was the morning sun, the girl peered through the window, only to find a turquoise blue comet shimmering at her. I think I did read this. The little girl shook the sleeping Luma awake and shouted excitedly, We have to get that comet! I think I did! Well, I'll read it again! The pair descended on the comet and found that it was made out of ice. They looked high and low, but Luma's mother was nowhere to be found. Exhausted, the little girl sat down to flop, utterly unable to take another step. Look! Peering down at the icy ground where Luma was pointing, the girl suddenly noticed clusters of star bits encased in the ice. I remember reading encased in the ice. There's ice here, but it's so warm, blah, 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 fuck you. Writing the turquoise comment, the appear learning the search for Luma's mother. Uh, chapter 4, let's see if I read this shit now. I think I did as well. The dream, I was, this one I was like, is that her fucking mom? Without turning mother reply, don't forget to hear us anywhere. Maybe I didn't read this. Yeah, I remember this because it's fucking face. I'm wasting my fucking time right now, bro. 
Well, let's remember I accidentally skipped the last couple pages, so after this, we'll, we'll read. When she awoke, the girl's face was damp with tears. You have star bits in your eyes, said Luma to the girl. Wiping her face, the girl replied, These are tears, not star bits. I'm crying because I'll never see my mother ever again. At this point, Luma began to cry too. Mama, oh mama, Wah! The pair traveled through the starry skies, and though they encountered many other comets, not one of them held Luma's mother. Luma was despondent. Now, now, Luma, the rain clouds won't go away if you keep crying, the girl said, giving Luma a squeeze. I'll give you a present if you stop. The girl closed her eyes and said gently, I'll take care of you. With these words, she felt a small spark in her heart. Chapter 5, I don't think I did this one. Home, this is the end. <gasps> the garden, or the gate. The kitchen will go here, and the library will go over there, the girl said busily to herself. We'll put the gate here. <laughs> Ever since the girl took Luma under her care, she'd been bustling about at a feverish pace. It's a lot of work, but it's worth it to make a happy home. It turned out that star bits weren't the only things buried in the ice. There were tools and furniture unlike any they had ever seen, and the girl used them to build a home. Looking at the completed house, Luma remarked, Don't you think it's awfully big for just the two of us? With a library, bedroom, kitchen, fountain, and gate, it was certainly spacious, but still, something seemed to be missing. If only my father, brother, and mother were here, the girl said wistfully. Indeed, the house was too large for its two small resident residents. Sorry, I was reading a little fast. That night, clutching her favorite stuffed bunny close to her heart, the girl fell asleep in the starship. Oh, the bunnies. Chapter 6. Friends. Then one day, while the girl sat sipping tea, a tiny apricot-colored planet appeared on the horizon. The fuck? From the planet, another Luma of the same color emerged. Do you two know each other? The girl asked the two Lumas gleefully. Despite the girl's excitement, they seemed uneasy. Hmm... The two Lumas neither drew closer nor backed away from each other. Instead, they just stared. Then one Luma broke the silence. My mama! <gasps> At once, the apricot Luma parroted back, My mama! My mama! My mama! My mama! The two Lumas began to dance around the girl frantically, and neither showed any sign of stopping. The girl was so charmed by this adorable scene that she couldn't help but laugh. <laughs> and that's when something very strange happened. <gasps> Suddenly, more Lumas began to pop out from the apricot planet. They were different colors, but they all shouted the same thing. My mama! My mama! The sight of all the shouting Lumas only made the girl laugh harder. What am I going to do with all these children? <laughs> the Lumas just stared blankly as she doubled over laughing. <laughs> I guess we'll, we'll have to name one of each and every one of you. Tomorrow, once she had finished naming them all, she would begin moving all the Lumas into the new house. Chapter 7! The Telescope! After seeing their 100th comet, a sudden thought popped into the girl's head. I wonder if my home planet is still as blue as it was. That's when she remembered her father's telescope. Hmm. Peeking into the telescope, a tiny blue dot floated into sight. It was smaller than a star bit. How strange. It's so far away, but it feels so close. She twisted the knob of the telescope and the blue dot grew until she could make out a grassy hill dotted with flowers. It seemed very familiar to her. Zooming even closer, a terrace on the hill came into view. Terrace! Ah! I used to go stargazing there when I lived on my home planet. She remembered rubbing the sleep out of her eyes as she followed her father up that hill to look at the stars. She remembered how she and her brother would sled down that hill. Rosalina has a brother. She remembered having picnics with her mother on that hill on bright and windy days. And... I want to go home! I want to go home right now! The girl burst into tears and the Lumas didn't know what to do. I want to go home! I want to go back to my house by the hill! I want to see my mother! The girl was shouting now, her face wet with tears. But I know she's not there. I know all. I knew all along that she wasn't out there in the sky because... Because... She's sleeping under the tree on the hill. The girl's cries echoed through the stars, and a hush fell over the area. Oh my god, we're still fucking going here? Jesus Christ. Chapter 8, The Wish. I didn't realize I had this many unlocked. Though usually quite cheery, one day the girl became sad again. Luma drew close and tried to comfort her. Mama, you still have me. And don't be sad about your mama because she's a part of you. That means she's always close by. It's like me. I love star bits because they remind me of my mama. No. No, the girl said, unable to stop the tears. Oh, that's a happy little Luma. A lonely look flickered across Luma's face, but it was soon replaced by a wide grin. I have an idea. 
I will transform into a comet, a soaring comet that can carry you all on this journey. With that, Luma trailing bands of white soared high into the sky and just as quickly started to plummet back down. Kaboom! Kablam! The ground shook and a bright light poured out of the crater that the Luma had created. The bands of light twisted together to form a comet tail, and then Luma emerged, reborn as a comet. The girl could scarcely believe her eyes. But how? She kept asking. Our destiny as Lumas is to transform into different things, said a red Luma who had suddenly appeared. Stars, comets, planets, we can become all, all of these things. When I grew up, I want to become a star that makes someone special smile, said a green Luma. A blue Luma chimed in. That Luma turned into a real cutie of a comet, didn't he? How cheerful. All of the Lumas together said, no more crying, Mama. Thank you, said the girl in a whisper, and she pulled the Lumas close and hugged them. From that day on, star bits no longer fell from the girl's eyes. Tears as we know them. <laughs> the comet set forth for the girl's home planet, its long tail blazing proudly behind it. Oh my god, is that the last chapter? Jesus fucking Christ here. Final chapter! Okay, okay. Family. With its many lumas and telescopes, the comet was quite a sight to behold. The girl and the lumas were proud to call it home. At a welcoming party for a new Luma, the girl gathered everyone in the kitchen and said in a louder voice than usual, All right, everyone, let's make a cake. A cake sprinkled with star bits. Then it will be a star cake. The Lumas excitedly began to gather the ingredients. Where'd they get the fucking ingredients? As she watched the Luma scurry about, the girl smiled and thought to herself, This is my family now, and I will stay with them until they're ready to leave the nest. And when they do leave, I'll see them off with a smile. Because that's what makes a mother happiest. That night, when the girl lay down to sleep, a soft light enveloped her and reminded her of the blue planet she once called home. But it would be nice to return home once every 100 years to nap in my favorite sleeping nook. The comet carrying the Lumas and the girl continues on its journey to this very day. With more family members in tow than can be counted, it's, sad, it's said that the comet visits the girl's home planet once every 100 years, its proud white tail glittering in the sky. The End beautiful uh, it's cute it's it's inspiring it's cheerful that's all my story is finished do i get a star for finishing it they should give me it this is if i want to fucking read that shit again they should give me a star for reading it the whole thing i don't know but yeah i mean you know it's kind of stupid but it, it's cute poor lumas and rosalina is like a celestial fucking space traveler she's like fucking star lord she just lives forever star lord's dad ego uh but yeah we'll, we'll call that the episode for now glad i finished it i still think rosalina is princess is uh, princess peach's mom she just looks too much alike and uh that's what or maybe it's the other way around peach is somehow her mom i don't know maybe they're sisters maybe it's her brother you know i don't know who knows who's to say but that's the end of the episode so uh take care guys peace